Now that we have power back, welcome back to some more Stormworks. I am Stormrunner Gaming, and today we have four solar planes here. And why, you may ask, we have four solar planes? I wanted to bring them out here and test if the solar planes actually work. Because you guys have requested me try to build my own, and yet I did not have enough time to design my own. They do take a little while to build, but I grabbed four pretty awesome planes from the workshop. And I'm going to be testing them out here. So so we've got the four planes and we also do have a hitchhiker I did pick up in the sky what's going on guys how's everybody doing today <laughs> so let's get on with it all right guys so up first we're checking out bot Fraser's creation it's an ultra light um, and it does it says it's not hundred percent efficient yet or he said it's not hundred percent efficient yet uh, but he says it does recharge over time um, and it is pretty fast so let's uh let's check it out give it a whirl all right let's see what it does all right we got controls running and some throttle here we got it moving um uh it's not yeah guys it doesn't look like this plane actually controls very well i mean i might not be the best pilot granted but it doesn't Especially on the ground. I, I haven't even been able to fly this plane yet. And um, I didn't put a microprocessor on it to test out those values. Because the creator already said that um, it isn't 100% efficient. So it actually does lose, va lose battery or lose value for it. So we're just going to move on to the next plane. Alright, now we are in the cockpit of this little ultralight. And let's give it a whirl. Let's see. Battery charge is 100%. All right, let's go. 100% throttle. Let's roll. Uses arrow key and WASD for other movement. That's moving. That's moving let's really fast. Oh, we like are airborne. Up. Nice. So it is controllable to some extent. That was a bit wrong there. It's um, it's not bad actually. It's um. Yeah, I just can't fly planes. How um, uh, how well it's flying though. It's really nice. You can be able to land it. Let me see. I'm coming in right now. I've got a life preserver if you don't make it. Just throttle down a little bit. Um, speed. No, 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 no. Bring speed up. Bring speed up. No. Oh. All right. Okay. Throw the life preserver. That really That's didn't go as planned. Not the. Um, and I'm All right. Here comes the life preserver. You ready? Ready? <laughs> okay. Hit the water. Did you get it? No, I'm a little far away from you. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on. I don't have cannons for arms. Are you kidding me? Let's just get to another plane. There goes our safety deposit. Well, unfortunately, I did not get a chance to land that one. Um, I ended up putting that one down to the bottom of the seabed, but that's all right. On to the next one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so this one is a creation by... Who? Do you know who this is? I do Princess. not know. I like the design of it though. I think it's pretty cool. Um, yeah, yeah, it, it looks pretty cool. And as far as I know, it runs pretty fast. I have put my microprocessor on here, so I did add in a power production dial here. So, and we can actually fly in this, and I'm pretty sure, as I've tested before, I can get it off the ground. We may not want to um, suck up Attaboy into the blades though. That Go might for it, be I'm bad. Are those are large motors on both wings or mediums. Maybe those are mediums. I think they're mediums, yeah. It's a lot of power though. Then again, it, it's a plane. It needs a lot of power. That's it's pretty it. cool looking. I dig it. Yeah, it's pretty lightweight though. So I think we're. Oh, I think it takes off quick. Yeah, yeah, we're already off. And there we go. It is a little bit um, springy with the controls. It likes to waggle its tail back and forth. A little bit direct with the controls, but I can keep it decently under control. And I'm going to look. We're actually losing 0 0.01 power per second at full throttle. So if I can slow it down a little bit, we're still losing a bit of power at 72%. But the dial doesn't tell us how much power we're actually losing. And I don't think I can keep it up in the air at 70% power. We are fluttering with danger here. Right, let's push it up to 90 and yeah it seems like 
are going to be losing. Even though we have that huge battery nestled under the middle of the wings here, it does not look like we can have a very long flight with this. Even though it's pretty darn fast and not too bad to control. So, actually do... I think... It seems it to be... a little unstable. Yeah, it's a little bit... Well, that's... The controls the control. are touchy. We'll call yeah. it controlled chaos. Like, basically, <laughs> the flaps are off or on. It's zero... Oh, shoot. Uh oh mountain. Mountain. Yep, yep, I'm on the mountain. Oh, yeah. yeah wait, wait, it. wait. Recover? Do I have that? Oh, another mountain. Nope. This nope. is not going well for me. As I said, I cannot fly planes to save my life, quite literally. <laughs> The last time I tested this, it ended up in an explosion, so rightfully so that I leave it on its lid here in a mountain. Surprised it didn't explode, though. Then again, we don't have an engine to give us that extreme no, everything explosion. Everything is all electric. All right, now, most of these planes have been self-explanatory. You jump into them, you drive. This one has baffled me. Why would they design a door like this? Apparently, Attaboy's still picking up his remains in the ocean. Right? Okay, if we swing into the door, we're gaining some momentum. Gaining some momentum? I I think this is uh, doing nothing, isn't it? Yeah, it's doing nothing. Hmm. If we get a box, we can jump on it. You see, this is the anti-theft device. You must have the key barrel to get inside the plane. Once you get the barrel, you can jump on said barrel and get inside. Without it's made the barrel. By Ludmeister. Who's that made by? Ludmeister. Hey, the barrel. The, the, why would you disrespect the? You can't get in the plane now. Yes, I can. I have complete control over it. I've locked it down. You do not have the barrel key. <laughs> In case you guys are wondering how to get into this plane, too, um, all you got to do is hold the button down, grab the handle, crouch, and then spin yourself, well, kind of spin spin yourself into the plane. And once you get in, just hit Q again to let go of the handle, and you are in. See, he's hacking it. You need, you actually need the key barrel. That's definitely no what you need. No barrel. Yeah, barrel. barrel. All right. Barrel Let's go. Is the Take key. All right, full Take power. What, what, what is it doing? There's nothing. Are you full power? Air oh, propellers, is that a 100%? Huh? Turn the pitch of the propellers. On the handle, the right hand side. There you go. Oh, 100%. Go! Alright, she's at full. We're gonna wreck. Power. We're gonna crash. Oh, no. Uh, oh, it's, no. it's scraping. Oh, no. Oh, um. Oh, oh. That, oh. did, mm, that didn't help Two very wheels. much. Oh. No. Whoa. 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 Come on. Keep her okay. going. Let's get her in the sky. Take two's got to be a little bit better than take one. Take Whoa. one's coming back to life. <laughs> no. Come on. A little Hello. bit more power. Are we gaining or it's, losing power, actually? We lost it. We are in the drink. We're losing a little bit of power. Let's get it up in the sure. sky. Because apparently neither of us can fly a plane correctly. I mean, she's got the power. We need to send it off the runway. There you send go. It. Here we go. Nice. It We're is up, up in the air now. Yeah, yeah. We are now free to move about the cabin. Golden. And we are losing a bit of power, though, on that microprocessor. That may be a bit of a problem. What are our batteries looking like? Ah, 95% isn't bad. But apparently, Adabo can fly a plane pretty well. I mean, I'm not taking precautions already to get out of the plane. Well, like I said, it was, crashes. Yeah, it was just pilot error or the other c crashes that we're having there experiencing. Yes, exactly. The plane pilot actually flies error. pretty smooth. It's not too bad. But yeah, we are losing electricity, and I don't know, is it... Wait, what? No, it is losing. Yeah, it's definitely losing. We're done at point nine one. Um, how high do you need for a uh, parachute to go off? Ooh, I don't know. Yeah, I just jumped out of the plane with the parachute and it didn't go off. <laughs> do you have to hit a key for it? I don't similar. know. If you guys do know um, how to set up a parachute, uh, a personal parachute you pick up, 
do you need to press a key? Or when I tested it forever ago, it was just automatic at a certain height it would go off, so I don't know, but it looks oh, like I've got a uh, long swim back here to get to that fourth and final plane. So our last creation that we have here is made by Tommy, and you can find all these creations on the Stormworks um, Steam Workshop area. This is Paradise, and this is not a completely solar um, plane. It's, I guess, a mixture of electric motors and solar panels. So I guess it self-generates off that by itself. I don't know if it does. That's pretty cool. Um, so let's check it out and see how it flies. Uh all right, so let's take it for a spin. We jump in. All right, fourth and final plane. Adam, are you ready for this one? Let's go. So far, we have yet to actually get one that's a hundred percent refueling, basically with energy. I don't know. But then again, like this one self is self-efficient. You mean? Yeah, self-efficient refueling. Yeah. Um, keeps the batteries charged. I have my power production label on here, or my microprocessor on here, so we can actually see what kind of values we're getting. Let's take off here. Give the throttle a little bit more. Oh. Looks like he has an electrical connector on the back side of it to recharge batteries. Um, ah, we're already up. Very cool. Yeah, that's this thing is a beast, man. This thing takes off real quick. It yeah. reminds me of like a, a Porter Pilatus, I guess that's the name of the plane. It's a turboprop plane, but this one, of course, is electric. I do not know planes. But yeah, this guy is running his off of electric, and it seems to be pretty smooth as well. He has that little turning wheel at the back, and it seems like it may be 100% lossless. We are not losing any battery power. No energy loss? Yeah, it does look like he's got some weird generation values here, though. We also do have autopilot, which I'm happy to use. Let's hit a cruising altitude of 1,000 instead of 10,000. I see. <laughs> Straight oh, up, gonna... is that how we get gain altitude right away? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's uh, autopilot is the one. You see, I'm just such a uh, horrible pilot. <laughs> Yeah, we right. are straight up at the moment. It's supposed to level out at about a thousand, but the autopilot is very gently. It's supposed to be a luxury ride. How would you like your drink, the sir? Holding. The battery's holding. That's pretty good. I'm yeah. flying Shot. around the uh, plane. Oh, okay, here. now we're nose diving. Yeah, it's going That's back funny. down to a thousand altitude here. So it should. Yep, we're pulling up again now. That PID system working perfectly. It's doing its own aerobatics or something. Acrobatics. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, it's pretty good. It also has a gyroscope, so that is good and bad for us. Good because uh, it keeps us very stable. But the only sad thing is we cannot pull off barrel rolls or flips on this thing. But somehow they've designed it so it's... I assume this thing can run forever. Uh, if you are tall, though, you may have a problem getting back to the drinks. A little bit tight back here. Very Ooh, cool. A little plane. bit tight. Yeah, yeah. Glass cockpit all around up here. That's pretty cool, so you can look around. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, you're looking at a wing when you're looking straight up out the wheel class there, but it still gives a cool effect. Yeah, Maybe yeah. It has a little lighting or so. And we're diving down again. Okay. Why are you diving down, Attaboy? I'm not diving. I'm not even driving this plane today. I'm not driving. <laughs> you're not driving the plane? I'm not driving no. the plane. I I'm going to become a passenger. I guess taking us for a wild ride. Yeah, yeah. It's that ghost pilot water, again. I think. I'm seeing water coming up real quick. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're going to the drink. There we are. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll turn the AC on. We we're covered. Oh. Well, I got the heaters on. Hopefully that'll... Oil the water dry out of the plane. Yeah, and then the um, AC will preserve. Um, we'll get some ice in here for the drinks <laughs> through the AC. They preserve okay. the drinks. Yeah, yeah. Um, probably shouldn't have cut throttle so early, but we didn't have any parachutes on there though. Like for such an expensive plane, you'd think they'd <laughs> uh, put parachutes on it. Well, I don't think we're supposed to try to crash this one. Yeah, Not yeah, I kind of just turned the throttle off at one of those points. <laughs> I mean, um, the ghost driver just didn't have his pilot's license. 
Didn't know how to fly it. Exactly. That's what happened. All right, guys. So this episode ended like most of my plane episodes with a plane crashed either in the ocean or somewhere on land in a mountain in this case. Anyway, it looks like this one plane that I did crash into the ocean seems to have a lossless system with whatever voodoo it has with that um, electric engines, gearboxes and a generator. It seems to be able to keep power in those batteries and fly and it's actually a pretty nice vehicle so of course if you guys do want to pick up any of these vehicles the link will be down in the description below in the links tab in the links tab as well you guys can go check out attaboy and subscribe to stay up with some more stormworks because he does a lot of stormworks on his channel as well but anyway that is where i will be ending the episode here so if you guys like this please leave a like and consider subscribing to the channel to stay up with stormworks and more of my content but i've never been ready goodbye so if you need me and i need to go